Hey everyone, my name is Notlet. Welcome back to the Invincible. Now, uh, as you can see here, this is kind of refreshing on what we we just did. Uh, Yasana, uh, ya Yasna, Yasna, right? Uh, decides to break procedures and give Gregory her oxygen. She then carries him to an open area so that Novik may send the lander to rescue them. <clears throat> so that's where we left off. Now, uh, we're gonna have to see if it brought us back what? exactly. Yeah, okay. Oh, what was that? Great question. You, you doing alright? We good? Astrogator, I, I, I'm underground. It's hard to determine my exact location. Novik. Oh, I can, I can move, I'm sorry. Cool. So, although I've been talking that this game has a very slow progression, I... I'm actually... I don't mind it too much. Anyone, please. Okay. Stay calm. Just... Keep it together. Keeping it together. I'll you got crazy. it. How how can you tell that on there? All it tells you is your oxygen level and your uh uh what was the other thing? Temperature, was it? Uh if it only tells you those two things, how can how can you tell you height heart breed space? Oh I guess you can feel it, I don't know. <laughs> I'm overthinking things, I think. Alright. Oh, a cool thing too, by the way, that I can do, and I'll maybe not yeah, you know, I can show you guys real quick. I can go here, go to photo mode, and you can see my character. It's kind of cool. I've been able to do that in certain games. But the thing I'm very curious is I don't really think I've seen my character's face. Um, but this isn't a good place to see it. You can kind of see her face, but anyways. Um, Deposit of water. Probably unsafe for consumption. I don't know till you try. I'd not risk it. I'd risk it. Meteoric waters. <clears throat> No, too deep. Let's Nothing's ever too puzzle. deep. Otherwise, I'll never reach the surface. <sighs> Slippery terrain. Poor visibility. I and then deeper. Situation hopeless. I don't say that. At least I got flat. You're calculating things like a machine. Gotta be kidding me. Does it even work? Oh. <laughs> well, that's kind of unfortunate. Oh, yeah. Eh, who needs flares, anyways? Whoa. What happened there? That was weird. Okay, you good? Are we, are we gonna keep trying at it, or? Huh. Interesting. I am very curious about this. I really hope it goes in some more alien routes. I really want that okay. for this game. Careful, Careful indeed. Oh, oh no! No, uh, stop. Okay, that was close. No chance. No hope. Deep abyss. Narrow passage. What? All right, watch your language. That's my considered opinion. Fucked. <laughs> Why did I just tell you? <laughs> All right. Um, what happened? Did I pass out? Was I supposed to make a quick ch ch choice? Oh, hi. Hello. Um. Who's that? Uh, Krauts, is that you? But how? Koval. Please, speak to me. It's, it's not Koval. Well, I don't really know who it is. I'm, I'm, I'm so glad to see you, Yasna. I have so much to tell you, but we don't have time. We need to get out of here as soon as possible. Um, 
How do I get to you? How are you planning to do it? I won't jump over to you. There's a passage on the left. It should get easier from there. Meanwhile, I'll be watching you from above. As long as we have comments, you are not me. We'll be out of here within an hour. You're not Koval. Tell me how you got here. anywhere until you tell me how you got here. Yes, no, we really don't have time for this. It's not safe here. Please, stand up. Seems safe enough right now. Yeah, that's that's not that's not anybody I know. So much for the rescue. I may think it is, but I don't think I think there's more. I think it might be biological metal impersonating humans. I'm thinking maybe maybe none of the people I rescued are actually human. Maybe they're all aliens just with our body. <laughs> like, they haven't mastered human speech, that's why they talk so weird. Um, I saw, I saw an interact- Oh, there it is. There we go. Thought I saw something. Yeah, I think if there's more to this, there's gonna be a twist that I'm not expecting. And that, that would be... That would be the kind of twist I'd expect. Go uh what? A cobble, say something. I can't stand this silence. Do you want to do that? Do what? Talk into your fool. There's no shame in being afraid. Who Don't seems worry. to know me? Uh I can die down here, you know. <laughs> eh. Kinda. I'm at risk of dehydration. A hypoxia poisoning. It's no wonder I'm afraid. Uh, go this way. I already admire you. You know, I'm proud and rather worried at the same time. What you did for Gorski, well, I wouldn't be able to do that myself. I don't know why I left him my tank. Gorski is dead anyway. Don't say that. We will return. How did he know? Something attacked me up there. Oh, it probably got him too. Then we'll ask Nobby. The old man monitors our parameters. Uh, he only tells us what he deems fit. Uh -huh. You know that, Koval. Uh, yeah, Who is Koval? I can't remember. Which one is that? I did the right thing. Is oh, maybe it I did. the guy in the beginning? But I was stupid too. Complete failure of reason in an act of futile heroism. Uh, uh, is your equipment operational? Nothing damaged? Hey! Hey, don't go so fast! Uh -oh. I need to rest. Why Hang in there. Ow. <laughs> that sounded like it hurt a bit. I've had enough. Just enough. Forward, Yasna. Faster. Oh, you're talking. Sorry, you're talking about yourself. I'm sorry. Come on. We're fighting for our lives, Yasna. Enough of this nonsense. I can't move, but. I'm sick of fighting. Okay, Yasna. I'm sorry. You big crybaby, get up. <laughs> Too much. Um. You don't have to apologize for anything. I, no, I don't really like any of these options. Maybe Novix. But definitely not yours. Stop. I'll be here with you until the end. Remember, none of this is your fault. You deserve to finally rest. Um. I know what you're trying to do. Oh, don't feel sorry for me, Koval. You know how much oh. I hate it. I do. You keep telling yourself that you don't deserve even the slightest compassion. <laughs> like I said, I'll be here. 
Cove was a nice guy. Even if he is an alien. I'm getting up, okay? I just can't stand listening to you anymore. Let's go. Ooh, wait, what? Uh, I don't know if I can. I can handle, I have to. I can do it. Yes, I can. I will not give up. Positive reinforcement. You got this. Moment of weakness, but we powered through it. You got it. That's a that's a glitch. <laughs> yeah, that was a weird glitch right there. Thank goodness. I've climbed up steeper. See, you, you made it. are an alien. My whining did some good, didn't it? What is this place? Yeah. Yeah, I kind of did. Oh, oh, that's bad. Hey, why can't I get to you? I don't like how I can't get to you. Um. Can I, um... I don't trust you. You may have Koval's face. <laughs> Would you say that's a trustworthy face? I do not know. This thing doesn't always work too well. Okay, never mind. The thing's not working anymore. Okay. <laughs> uh, just once you zoom in, you can't unzoom or anything. Ooh, skeleton! Do you see this? Well, if you're talking about the coal deposits and the bones of prehistoric reptiles, Ooh, wow. then yes, they're further up as well. Cool. Uh, what could that mean? Where was life on land after all? There was life on land after all. What do you think that means? Man, yeah, might as well ask. Well, isn't it obvious? Dinosaurs once lived on Regis 3. That's cool. Are you mocking me, Covel? No. Not at all. Millions of years ago, this planet had to be teeming with life until something got rid of it all. Probably the aliens. It was definitely the aliens. Uh, an asteroid killed them, or something is blocking life. Let's do that one. It didn't allow organisms ashore. Or perhaps it stopped them from leaving the water. If so, I think it stops them to this day. In other words, it's still here, and it nips all manifestations of life in the bud. Why huh. then have I not met it yet? We oh. might have. I'm afraid you might have. Yeah. Ah, uh, wait, hang. Uh, you know a suspicious amount, Koval. Why are you so cut on Novik? Novik won't leave without us, right? Yeah, let's say that. You know a lot, Koval. About what happened to me. About these fossils. The old man told me. Uh, about life on Regis. About you. He's clueless regarding Regis. Only cares about gaining some illusory advantage in this sector of the galaxy. Even more fossils. And now there are no comms. No uh -oh. one will even know about this discovery. Oh. oh but I still have Kovo, so right? I really don't like the idea of our bones resting next to these ones. Well, at least an HQ will send another expedition. And they'll find all the bones together. Uh huh. Might be their downfall, though. I always see you walk by now. Ow. Okay, I'm gonna try to move a little bit faster here. There he is. There's the guy, always out of arm's reach. Uh, how did you end up on the other side? Are you really here with me? Let's just do that. He's not gonna be honest. Are you really here with me? Of course. As well as the whole crew. You have very distinct memory traces of us all. In this marvelous little thing of yours called the brain. Stop joking. You know that's not what I'm asking about. I do. But there's no definitive answer, really. I just hope you won't forget about us. About me. So little, yet so much. I don't want to forget, Cobble. Either way. I really don't. 
The way you're talking makes me really worried. I don't like it. Come on. It's time to be among other people again. They're out there, somewhere. You're not actually speaking, Koval. I, uh, I don't I don't trust you. I don't know what you are, but you're not Koval. I'm sorry. And I think this game is really letting me know that. And you're gone, aren't you? Koval, gosh darn it. <laughs> <laughs> Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Well, you ain't here, that's for sure. I'm coming to get you, Kavl. Good old Kavi, coming for you. I'm starting to have second thoughts. What if something's waiting for me? Something that calls my fall. You don't know me. You're not my dad. No. <laughs> Where are you? What? Why didn't it, uh... Am I imagining him? Oh, is he all in my mind? That could be it, too. Maybe it's like a hallucinatory thing. You know, honestly, that probably would make a little more sense. Uh-oh. I'm blacking out again. Well, this is an inconvenient. <laughs> oh, there we are. Lovely. Cool. Uh-oh. Something happening. Something I should know. Well, this is cool. Are you? Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm here. Astrogator, I, I'm here. Over. It's me. Sir. You'll never guess who I met. I saw Koval. <sighs> I don't quite Whoa. understand myself. All right, let's leave that for now. Are you injured in any way? Uh, no. As usual, I came out of trouble unscathed. Whoa! You just had to say it. Are you there? Whoa, whoa, what is that? This got interesting. What the what kind of deadly shit is this? That is so cool. There's something here. It looks like a machine. It burned a hole in the wall. And I was watching all these kind of crab legs. Cool. But it looks like the robots that we have. Uh, do you know what it is? I recognize the thing. I do. Actually, I recognize this noise. It's a damn thing that dropped me underground. I think it's moving away from me. Okay. Uh huh. How did the lions get here so soon? Is it possible that the Alliance machine got here before us? I'd like to know myself. If our intel's incorrect and invincible when it landed on Pages 3, it would have a huge advantage over us. So why would they confront our ship head on? <laughs> Instead, they waste time on some shady diversion. Exactly. I can see a passage, but it doesn't look very... Inviting? Ah, oh, what? Is, oh, oh, no. Shit. Stuck. How am I? How am I stuck? Whoa. That's cool. It's getting closer. I have nowhere to run. It's getting closer. It's gonna crush me. I've got no Oh. Oh, Luna. Luna to the rescue. 
Damn, that's cool. Uh-oh. Not Luna. Dang. I don't know how I survived. The probe did something. The machine is dead. I'm okay. The probe did something. As if... But it wasn't... I don't know. I don't know. It's protecting you? I saw the readings. They were distressed. It followed a series of directives that I didn't implement. Currently, it does not respond to commands. I'll check on it. I guess it's busted for good. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I'm sort of, uh, sort of caught up at the moment. Crap. Oh, <laughs> well, that worked. The fell down. Probably from the registry. Can you get the record? Let's see. I have no idea what I'm doing, but I hope you do. Okay. Oh. Cool. You guessed right, sir. The Alliance is indeed already on the planet. Okay. They even managed to set up a fill base. How could headquarters have got it so wrong? According to intelligence, the Invincible is not due to arrive for another 14 days. Uh, I guess we should ask them back home. Interesting. So it's like some sort of conspiracy. Because, yeah, I was going to say that robot is designed as the rest. Oh, that's that's you. That's me. Wow. It really did almost flatter me. It's close up. Cute. Keep that one for later. <laughs> Probe. It it distracted the antimats. You say that as if it did it on purpose. I think it might have. How else to explain it? Yeah, no kidding, right? Coincidence. I don't believe in such coincidences, Astrogator. Whoa, is that a planet? That's not good, okay. Interesting. Anything else or is that it? That seems to be it. Interesting, okay. This is getting a lot cooler now. I mean, it. the game started very slow, but now I'm kinda into this. This seems intriguing to me. Luna! Luna! Not much left of it. Of her! Luna! I'm gonna find that it has, like, the, uh, uh, material from the, the ground and everything. The, the, like, root stuff in there or something. That'd be interesting. Since I found the probe. I haven't been alone. Oh, cute. Sorry, Maybe it can still be rebuilt. Anyway, you're not entirely alone. I feel like I've lost another companion. No need to despair. It's just a machine. I'm just a little sad. No, I feel like I lost a friend. I've lost another companion. Because Luna was my friend. My last one. You still have me. Not down here. Oh, what? What just happened? What? Uh, okay. Don't know why you cut me off like that. That was weird. Uh, sorry, what? Okay. Hey, cool down. Are you talking about the protocol? Huh. Well, they say in order to win over a person, huh. you have to steal their heart. But the key is to get their brain. You know that's wow. just a method. Oof. Anatomically incorrect and highly overused, yes. Okay. Okay. Time to get out of here. Uh, let's go, I guess. Dang. Interesting. <clears throat> you say continue excavation, I'm pretty sure that ain't what I'm doing. What is that this time? Stormfront is approaching your location. Oh boy. Of all times. Yeah, that's not great. Let's not forget that the alliance is in the vicinity. Wait a minute. 
Do you have any specific expectations of me? Since I'm nearby their troops. It's hard to call them specific. We need to learn more. You're missing the most important thing, sir. We still have to save Gorski. Okay. I, I don't Check know what alliance. your silence means. Huh. No, tell me now. What? That's not. What? No. No, don't finish. That, that's impossible. You did absolutely everything you could. Unfortunately, sometimes even that's not enough. I Dang. Did nothing. Just nothing. By the way, how are you feeling? Shucks, I gave up my oxygen. And how am I supposed to feel? I mean, the lack of your oxygen tank. So you know. Uh huh. oxygen jump didn't come out of nowhere, and your saturation is dropping. How are you feeling? Eh, could be better. <laughs> Fine, I'm all right. It's bad. I've been hallucinating, but we don't know that yet. Nah, but it's gonna be honest though. I've already experienced what Doctor Crowther referred to as my well, honesty is best symptoms. Actually. Koval participated in them. Oh, damn it. The storm's getting worse. What? How? I had a long and heartfelt conversation with him. Uh, please don't ask for details. Oh boy. Okay. Apparently I'm heading the right way though. I, I haven't been entirely sure, but uh, apparently I've been doing good. Whoa. Crazy. Are those conducting electricity? Oh, sure they are. Whoa. Alliance Rover. Hey, I'll take a vehicle if I can. I found their vehicle. No. A rover. Rover right over. Oh, am I hearing the sounds of water hitting my mask? Is that it? Okay, I guess we're, I guess we're wandering. <laughs> I was hoping to meet someone. It's just tiredness. Uh. Not disappointment. Tiredness. Yeah, that makes sense. What? Oh, it's locked me in again. Wait, why? Am I taking the rover? I mean, I'd love to. I didn't think it was gonna let me, though. Okay, let me run back then. M maybe? Maybe not? Oh, oh, wait, hang on. Wait, I saw that. No, show it again. Oh, oh, there we go. Let's go, get out of the rain, yeah. Even if just to sit in here for a bit. Ah, oh, ah. Yes, but I still have to pop back outside. Um. What am I checking? Did Kovic come back? Or Korvik? Kor Kor I can't see anything with your hands up like that, you know? Okay. Oh, finally. Finally. What? What? Why does it say finally? I'm sorry, what? Oh, there we go. This wasn't working. Ah. Let's go, okay. I guess I'm lucky in that case. <laughs> was unexpected. Wait, that was Novik.
Yeah, take that with you. Yeah, there you go. Looks a lot larger than the one I had, too. Start the rover. Don't mind if I sure. <coughs> Will I get in the right seat this time, though? Um, apparently not. <laughs> there you go. I probably should have closed the door, but eh, it's whatever. Now, how's this bad boy work? Ah, ka-chunk. What? What? Oh, ah, there we go. Then what are you waiting for? Leave this cursed place. Okay. All right, cool. It's still progressing kind of slow, but it's getting cooler as it goes. Um, How are the conditions? I'm going. Please talk to me. And maybe that will calm me down. Um. Oh shit! What? Don't what? worry. What? Even if it hits the rover directly, you'll come out and skate. Yeah, the vehicle is, is kind of a parent cage. The, the energy will flow through the body, discharge into the ground, without getting inside. There are exceptions. I'm, not I'm a goddamn oasis of peace. I'm not moving. And there are exceptions, you know. Such as the windshield shattering at high voltage. Oh, there we go. Right bumper. Don't oh, I didn't know. Stress me out at all. Could have told me it was right bumper. I remember a mission on Eden 5. At that time, I was still a coordinator, but the crew was quite similar. Chemist, cyberneticist, a doctor, an um, engineer, and a physicist. Simple reconnaissance mission. But there was a miscalculation, and we crashed the rocket. Then we put it back together. <laughs> For whatever was on hand, it's quite a machine. A true Frankenstein monster, so to speak. What? Oh, wait. Creatures. Maybe you here? This up, aren't you, sir? I can't even see what I'm looking at. Um, I don't know what I'm looking at. I can't tell what I'm seeing, and I can't get out to investigate. Going around around what? I am so confused. I I don't know what I'm looking at. I whoa! I thought I was going into a hole. What the heck? Maybe here. Was oh, this where I need to be careful of electricity? Flooring it. Okay. Yeah, I can bait this way. How do I know? Okay. Thanks, I guess, for that. Where am I going? Okay. I'm assuming I'm heading the right direction. I don't like when you give me multiple paths, though. Do I make a right? Right's always good, right? Am I right or am I right? Blah. I think I just made a circle. Oh my gosh. I do not like... This is... Confusing as heck. Damn it! I'm having trouble finding the right way. You've got to head southwest. How am I supposed as to? As if know that where helps me. Is? Yeah. I don't have a compass. Remember. The city attracts lightning, so the fewer flashes on the horizon, the better. Uh, how far am I from the city's border? Considering how fast you're. Moving. I'm riding into a cave. The storm has subsided. Oh, okay, this must be right. I'm assuming. I can't tell where I'm going. I can't make left heads or tails of anything. Oh, okay, not my favorite segment. <laughs> I found a place to hide. A Faraday cage? Uh, that's not it. I left 
The structure's behind. Okay. It's an ordinary rock formation. Even better. We have to catch a breath eventually. Can I ask for one thing? Mm -hmm. Can I have a model number of the rover? <sighs> what for? I've got an idea, but it depends on the model. Okay. Uh, Emmett 2001. Space Odyssey. Uh, let me see. Bigger. Emmett's are equipped with a black box. Please find it. Hmm. Um. Ha. I can only go over this way. Is there. Oh. I have the box. But it's all locked up. Really? Uh, must have changed the equipment because I have no information about the key. Where Wait, this is Novik again. Their gear from, and anyway, it doesn't matter. What should I do? One second. I need to think. Don't know if this can help. But the Alliance labels black boxes as data loggers. Cable access. Look for something resembling a socket and a plug. Okay. I think I have something like that. Then you can connect to the probe's brain there. And press it. Okay. It won't work. These inputs are not compatible with Commonwealth plugs. Huh. From the outside, our equipment is different, but inside we have the same guts, so to speak. The cable on the back of the box should already fit. Okay. Same guts, hey? Just like with humans. <laughs> okay, thanks for making it weird. <laughs> Uh, what? Oh. None of this is incredibly obvious. Okay, it's in. Just a moment. Well done, Doctor. I'm receiving a signal. So I made a robot car. Cool. Oh, then you're gonna auto park it? was connected to a base. Base two. Uh, most probably. Oh, okay. Whoop. No one is transmitting from the base. Huh. I'd suggest you lie down. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I can sleep. Uh, I'll try to fall asleep. Is this going to be anything important? I mean, I'll talk if there's something important. Uh, I'll tell you what I saw underground. You know more about the Alliance than you let on. Read me the regulations. Ends the conversation. Um, Maybe I'll fall asleep if we talk. Well, I'd love to know some official secrets about the Alliance base. <laughs> the reason they're interested in this desiccated, bizarre planet that is Regis 3. Are you implying that I should know these secrets? Uh, implying yes. that you do. I think you're hiding something from me, sir. And at this stage of the mission, I lack both the strength and the inclination to beat around the bush. In that case, Straight to the point. Let me reveal something I should never say as a commander. I love you too. No, I'm just <laughs> Yeah, me too. Quite literally. So I suggest we talk about something else. Instead of getting out of ourselves. A more light-hearted subject, perhaps. Um, okay. And you, why did you become an astronaut? I wonder why I became... I wonder why I even applied for this job. I don't know if any of this is going to be important. Three years old, my father and I stepped out into the garden to gaze at the stars. And I cried. <laughs> Stupid, right? Were you afraid of the dark? Sort of. It felt like I was falling upwards. Being pulled in by the starry sky. The cosmos turned out to be so infinitely vast. And I was so infinitely small. And I didn't understand any of it. 
Why am I here? Why is everything here? And what is it for? I couldn't find an answer. So I cried. Hang on a minute. <laughs> Just want to see. You became an astronaut because the cosmos terrifies you. No. Because someday I want to understand. Or at least find as many answers as possible. And finally stop being afraid. I think we're getting more questions than answers. Trust me. I'm not fooling myself. Someday maybe I'll just know enough. That's fair. Uh, the Fremry Paradox comes to mind. And you? Why'd you become an astronaut? And you? I don't know if any of this is worth it. Maybe I'll just skip it. Falling asleep. <laughs> sure enough. <laughs> okay. Well, that's kind of cool. I've never seen them actually pull that off where it's like you fall asleep during conversation. Uh oh. Wait. Astrogator, can you explain to me what I'm hearing right now? This is a recording from the rover. The Alliance has apparently broken the encryption of our radio channel. Oh, bollocks. Hmm. So, so what do we do? We need to change the frequency and the encryption key. Okay. What's the meaning What's of that? The point? As soon as you give me a new channel, they will overhear us and change it as well. Just look at the probe's brain. Luna? What's with... Oh, those... All you have to do is watch it closely. I'm switching now. Waiting for you to join. Oh, I see. The new frequency is... <laughs> uh, the first air channel, second air channel, third air channel. What? I'm, I'm sorry, what? Third air channel? Because there's three? Okay, the channel is active. Now the encryption key. The first three digits of the cipher are... Three? Two? Seven. Okay. Three, two, seven. Uh, the next is... Two? One? Four. Two, one, four. Uh, which is why? That one. Sorry. Got a message. Okay. Yes, I'm here. Well done. That should buy us some time. So, how should we continue? Uh, don't you need more time to rest? I do. But there's no nah. way I'm going to sleep now. Besides, nothing's stopping me anymore. The storm has subsided. All right. Let's not risk evacuating directly from the city. Should be safer outside its perimeter. I took the liberty of looking through the photos of the nearby area. Everything north and east of your location looks relatively safe. So? Should we go back to the should ship? Go back to the ship? Sorry. That's an odd question. Of course you should come back. Now even more than ever. Very concerned for your safety, Doctor. Uh, hey, no I'm the doctor here. I'm fine. No, you're not. Okay. Um, it's very nice in here, but um, what am I doing? Oh, <laughs> I'm doing this. 
Ka-chunk. I don't think I'm doing this. No, I'm not doing that. Okay. I was gonna say, I haven't hit the gas yet. I don't know what's going on with that. Interesting. Once again, it is very slow paced. I really thought it was making a change. I thought things were speeding up a little bit, that we were getting a little more in our dialogues and stuff, but meh. Still kind of slow. There was a vast open area in front of me. Oh, I got control now. Astrogator. The city is no longer visible. We need to decide what to do next. Catch you later, Astrogator. Are you there? No, I'm out. Yes, please excuse me. I was in the infirmary. Is the coast clear? You okay? All clear. Good. Give me a moment. I'm looking at the satellite images. Whoa. I'm sorry, I don't want to miss this. Uh, how's Koval's condition? Have you examined Merritt's body? Oh. Have you examined Merritt's body yet? I wired her brain to a grave tapper, if that's what you're asking. Yes, grave tapper. that's what I meant. Huh. Have you watched the memory recording? Yes, but it doesn't say anything because the picture is ambiguous. To put it mildly, a lot of black dots. The graininess of the image is extremely bad. That's beautiful. Cool. Sector AZ25. Let's say AZ2504. Please check if it's fit to land. Um. Like I said, it looks good. Clear opening, flat terrain. Excellent. Please go there while I prepare the lander. I'll just pack Artie inside. Okay. Uh, so that's it. We lost. So that's it. You're taking me to the dragonfly. We're flying away from here for good. We have no other choice, Doctor. It's never that easy, though. The mission, we can only minimize losses. You understand that, don't you? Eh, I guess. Of course, yes, I want sir. to go back. I would consider other possibilities. Oops. What? You didn't let me finish, sir. Yeah, but I know what might be on your mind. Going back for Gorski's body, contacting the Alliance, or uh -huh. continuing research on your own. These are not possibilities. A certain death. Please remember, we have just one lander left. As a commander, I must first ensure your safe return. Only then I'll send uh -huh. Archie with other tasks. Okay, Dad. My gosh. Just, you don't let a girl do nothing. Road to the Alliance base. Oh, is it giving me another choice thing? Can I get out? Can barely see anything in there. Road to landing zone. Oh, so that's giving me the option to disobey. Now let's go to the landing zone. I'm, I'm gonna obey this time. I don't wanna be too rebellious, you know? He makes valid points and you know, honestly, I think it's a good idea. Yeah, I'm going to the landing zone. It's a weird choice uh, selection system. That is really interesting. Has a lander taken off? Yes, a second ago. Threshold of 18,000. The line's breaking up. Can you hear me? Where is it? What's happening? I've lost control of the lander. Do you see it? Just a sec. I have to get off. Um. Oh. It hasn't yet pierced a cloud cover. Oh, here it comes. There it is. Oh no. Flying too fast. Oh no. Oh boy. I don't know. All I see is a thick plume of smoke. But considering the speed it hit the ground at I, I Oh, it's not good. I don't understand how it happened. I checked it thoroughly. It's fully functional. Couldn't have been an accident. I don't believe it. I'm gonna check what's left of it. 
This looks in interesting. I, I do I do like this. Damage nozzle. Or the armchair. Crush door. I have no chance. What? I will for. die. What? No. How to go back? I will not come back. No, 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 no. I will die here. Oh, I'll die here. Oh no. Breathe. I'm gonna die here. And for what? I saved no one. No one. Oh, wait. Ooh. That's an order. We can't give up just yet. We'll find a way to get you out of there. I don't give a shit about your orders. Let's not pretend that everything is okay. Like nothing happened, and forget about my little nervous breakdown. What's Splendid. up with you? No, yes, sir. I'm not forgetting anything. Oh, so you'll put it in the report, sir? That's not what I meant. Hardy. Something's left of Artie. Yeah. Ah, Did he do it? There's a chance we can extract key information from it. Somehow it still looks active. Ask him what happened to the lander. Ask? But he doesn't speak. But he gives yes or no signals. Give him the analysis. Oh, really? Mark. Formulate questions in such a way so that he can confirm or deny. Okay. Um. Was it a storm? RT question analysis command. Did the lander fly into a storm? Apparently, he can't give a definitive answer. Huh. huh. Something like a storm. But a shade? Cloud. Oh. A cloud of something oh, disrupted it. What does it tell us? I don't know yet. Damn. It shorted out. So, what now? Then you must go to the Alliance camp. I wanted to avoid it at all costs. It was going to happen. Choice. This is your only chance. Um, they're behind it all. Regus 3 is to blame. That's that's a lot of accusations I don't really know, but... It's all because of this goddamn planet. I think it's the planet, maybe. I the Alliance is sick of it, too. Let's hope so. And I don't say this out of hostility. If they were in trouble, they might be more cooperative. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, we'll see. Dang. Okay, this is those parts are impressive. I like when these action sequences happen. It's just it's a lot of time in between of them, uh, in between segments, and I don't necessarily like that as much. But it's not bad though. Not bad. It could be worse. Could be worse. Could be worse. Excuse me. Oh. Back in action. Sometime later. Yes, what? Yes. Even if you're absolutely right, and this planet is to huh. blame, that doesn't make the Alliance our allies. We must be careful when dealing with them. First, observe them from a distance, and only then take action. Um, I would be careful as always. Maybe the rover will confuse them. Won't they take me for one of their own? If I'm riding an Alliance rover. Maybe I can enter the camp without arousing any suspicion. And Maybe. then I can decide for myself if I want to come out. That's a risky idea. Sooner or later they'll realize that the driver belongs to the Commonwealth. Instead of asking questions, they'll start shooting. Anyway, you'd have to know their internal codes. They see you but don't receive any signal, they'll immediately become suspicious. Do hmm. that. I'm just trying to think of something. Well, at least you're considering ideas, I mean. Hey! Hey! What was that? I've set up a warning signal. Now you're near enough that they can see the rover. I'm gonna hide out. Okay. Going in stealthily. Okay. The rover's hidden. You've yet to find a convenient hideout for yourself, from where you can see their base. Is there a crouch? No, there's no crouch. Oh, no, I'm just automatically crouching. Cool. Uh, I would like to, uh, yuck. It's a field base. 
multi-module for about several dozen people rather well equipped hmm they have a second anti-mat as if the first one wasn't enough is it active uh, probably not but proton alone knows This all looks like I'm looking at just a small model. It's really weird for some reason. There's lots of transporters here. I'm not surprised. Missions with a large what is that? Crew. Transport modules were an integral part of the field camp. Remind me, how many crew members were they supposed to send on the Invincible? Over a hundred. What is that? Right. What about people? Can you see anyone? Not yet. Maybe they're hiding in modules. Can we talk about the big thing? I'd be surprised if they didn't assign anyone to guard duty. Can we can we talk about this? Like what the heck is that? Okay. Ooh. I see a human silhouette with a Oh, sorry. <laughs> Wait, it was there for a second. You're not going to show me anything now? Is that just it? Okay. Guess that's that. Ooh. Some object is flying over their base. Can you tell me more? It's 15, 20 meters high. It has an upright silhouette. And it looks like a, a balloon. Uh, like a signal balloon. Be a balloon. And that doesn't surprise you? Not everything that flies needs jet engines. What markings does it have? It has an R... RB1. RB1. What does it mean? It's an ID number. Denotes an advanced scout balloon. How far from you is it? Around 400. Not as far as I would like it to be. Huh. Might have you within camera range. Uh oh. Is that all? I think so. And please keep going. Can we talk about the big thing? Detected your presence. Or it will soon enough. There's no point in further postponing the inevitable. Um, I shouldn't have stopped. I'm glad I stopped. No. Still. I'm glad that I stopped. I feel better knowing that there's no heavily armed military waiting for me there. Whoa. Me too, Doctor. There me seems too. to be a drone. Too bad I don't have a white flag. It's a Star Wars probe drone. <laughs> Little different. Little bit different. Okay. Um <coughs> I've taken a long way apparently. Great. Wait, could I just take my vehicle or? Because now they know I'm here. Nah, I stowed it for a reason. I don't know. I'm just getting on foot. I can see better, anyways. Hmm. Very 60 style. So let me be clear. Won't be easy to gain their trust. Things can go wrong, even if you can prove that you came to them of your own free will. If there's an escalation, remember one thing. I'll do everything in my power to negotiate your safe return to the Commonwealth. Worst case scenario, we'll opt for a prisoner exchange. Until then, please cooperate with them. Do and you have a prisoner to exchange? Don't resist. Astrobiologists generally do not possess information that's sensitive to the Commonwealth. At worst, you'll give away the details of our last mission. Of course, it'd be better if that didn't happen. But I know their methods of interrogation, and in all fairness, they're very effective. You act like I'm a spy. Ah, eh, I'll corroborate. You're forgetting that I want to talk to them. As one human to another, not as hey. enemies. I hope you're right, Doctor. But even if we disregard decades of mutual enmity, we must keep in mind human nature. Homo homini lupus. I don't know what, but to talk to them doesn't mean they'll listen. I'd rather expect they'll be asking the questions and you'll be answering them. I'm all right with that. 
Am I gonna drive that to their front door? Be like, sup? Check out my new ride. Weird rock formations. Really wish I had my vehicle. Are we hanging up? Uh, thank you for your church service. Since we have no idea what's gonna happen, I want you to know that you were always a fair commander, even if you were quite strict. <laughs> I guess what I'm trying to say is... Please, stop, Doctor. You can tell me when you get back, in person. Understood? Yes, <laughs> sir. Well, I'm like that with kind of building a relationship with my commander. That's kind of nice. It's good to know he's got my back. Yeah, what is this thing? I hate that we didn't talk about it. Like, what is it? Oh, it's a force field. Oh. Access to the base is protected by a force field. Hmm. If these are Dirac emitters, and I'm sure they are, nothing will get through. Is there an opening from the other side? I'll see. Hmm. Okay, I thought those were tentacles before. Nope, can't get it. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go on a ledge and say no. Ugh, this is even worse walking than Death Stranding. In Death Stranding, I could run. I could hold my bag and I could I could actually run, but her stamina is like non-existent, man. The most pathetic. Ugh. Yeah, I don't like these segments. I, I really much prefer when there's something happening. Uh, I don't know, this just gets so uneventful so quickly. And it get, then that starts to get boring. Couldn't I jump? I thought I could jump. I don't seem to be able to jump. Nope. I was just playing a, a awesome game called uh, Cordosis and a Cordosis, sorry. And it was so awesome. Don't wake up, big guy. What? There's no one here. It's abandoned. Could I take the robot? Impossible. Even if there aren't many of them in the camp, someone would have noticed you. I'm not blind. I'm going. What have I got to lose anyway? Your life, Doctor. Uh huh. Oh, that is cool. Now that makes background art right there. That's so sick looking. Oh, I love that. I love seeing robot creature designs. I love that kind of thing. Oh, and it's so sick. Okay. I'm going in. Uh oh. Clear. For now. Um. It's a note. I can't hear anyone either. Uh, Dying of the Sun, the article, the article rectification to editor so-and-so responsible for a scandalous article trashing my good name and diminishing my science achievements. I politely ask for a rectification of the article Dying of the Sun, a scientist, a scientist's threats on page 9 and 10 from the fifth issue of the science periodical Young Astrophysicist. I don't really know if any of this is important. I'll keep reading it though. Um, periodical young astrophysicist published in the current year in the text appeared not only fundamental mistakes of scientific nature, but also inappropriate quotations of my hypothesis delivered at the last Congress. I enclosed a correction. Uh, according to my, I remind the authorship, Dr. Boza, not Boza, <laughs> research conduct during cosmic voyages i acknowledge that the time of hydrogen burning out in stars depends on their masses uh but this phenomenon applies to all stars and ours however we would try to enchant the laws of physics 
it's located and nothing implies that it would be located outside the phenomenon's range. What is my hypothesis then? In the future, all hydrogen fuel in the sun's core will burn out. A sphere of hydrogenic fusion will expand until temperature drops below 10. Uh, the hydro uh, hydrogenic fire will serve as fuel, allowing a second round of fusion reactions to begin. It will lengthen the life of the aging sun by a few hundred million of years. However, it is certain the sun will turn from a yellow dwarf into a red giant star. A gravitational pull towards Venus and the Earth will decrease. Thus, the mentioned celestial bodies will succumb to distancing themselves from stars. As a result, they will be somewhat rescured, but they might they might the mighty red sun will yet be able to consume mercury before dying okay none of this is important i'm sorry i don't know why i spent time reading that that really wasn't anything of value for me okay um i'm kind of out of time for this episode um let me keep moving though Not much to see here. Okay. Moving on. It's still quiet. It's eerie. Huh. I don't get the formation of this. Wait. Good question. Uh, they were fleeing from something? They went somewhere. They're making fun of me. <laughs> they obviously went somewhere. What? Why'd you stop talking? Can I drive your base? <laughs> Apparently that's something I could do, huh? I'm at the central module. In the headquarters. Just like that. Uh-huh. Yeah. No one's here. The doors are open. Unbelievable. Just unbelievable. Huh. So I'm there now, okay. I'm at the control station. Several units can be controlled from here. Oh. I wonder which. I'm sorry, I don't get what I'm doing. What am I doing? I got the feed. But I can't get it to move. It's got a weak signal. Must mm. be too far away. So it's not this one. Is that what I'm understanding? Three has been a good number for us. Maybe it's that one. <coughs> I don't get what I'm doing. A view from above. It's a flying probe. I'm betting it's the one that detected my presence. Can you extract data from it? Sure. Never too much data. Especially in the current situation. I just need to find a place to land it. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I landed the probe. Perfect. <laughs> nice. Okay. Let me check it in this fair moment. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm supposed to end the episode here, but I'm still going. Uh. Hello. Uh. Hello. Oh, there we go. Search command room. Uh, hang on. Can I put this away? They've got a device for intercepting alarm signals. Uh, there isn't much of it. Single record. Okay. 
I have a record of their mission. Each step, location, all units, out. including dates. And all ears. Huh. Other ship. Day Zero, landing place. Their main ships in sector AQ-28. Deep principle. What? They didn't move it. Huh. Seems hmm. so. I'll try to track it down. Please tell me what else is in there. Well, like Carso became interested in the ocean. They got there on the seventh day. Huh. Before Carso. setting up this base, they were stationed not far from here. But seemed very they conducted research and during excavations found... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you won't guess. Metal structures. So we had no chance to outrun them. Yeah. And they were already at an advanced stage of works when we were still in orbit. Huh. I'm we confused. sent a convoy to a neighboring sector. So that was their last move? Well, there's no information about their return. Maybe I'll find them there. Maybe. Do you know what the current day of their mission is? They left on the 25th day. That's all I know. Well, I can't back out now. I have to follow them. Well, it's your decision. Although I admit I'm also starting to wonder what you'll find. People, Astrogator, they must be somewhere. I'm sending a satellite. Soon I'll have an image of the area where the ship landed. We'll see if the Invincible's still there. I'll continue to search their base. Hmm? Can I not... Can I not do that last one? On the oh, no. the 24th day, they sent a convoy north to the sector. Huh. Oh! To the sector where I found Gorski. Okay. I suspect they went after him, having detected his signal. Cannot be ruled out. It's hard to believe. Oh, surely they could detect him. They... They could have detected all of us. Yeah. So why didn't they? Really they do something about it. Well, for some reason they left their base. I'm assuming that has something to do with it. Uh, it does not make sense. Astrogator, this doesn't make any sense. No. You can't just wrap up the whole operation. Anyway, the first thing they would take were vehicles and equipment. Only the people are missing here. Huh. Okay. Um, unfortunately, though, I think this is where I'm going to call this episode quits. Um, <sighs> this game is unique. I'm going to say this. This game is very unique in the way that it progresses. I personally find it way too slow. I don't know. Maybe it's the ADD in me. Just, like, I, I, I find its progression just too slow i don't know it's like it's got some really cool moments but then it's just filled with walking and i i'm not one for a walking simulator i loved death stranding and i know that's considered kind of a walking simulator but that had action almost the whole way through and cool things happening whereas this is just i don't know it's not it's not pulling me as much as i'd like um I, I'm very curious about this. Like, I really want to know what's happening here and everything in the story, but I don't know. For now, I'm just... I don't know. I'm going to keep up with this, though. I'm going to keep going through this. Um, so far, it is just a very slow progression that is making me more tired while playing through this than anything. I don't like that. So, we'll see. Anyways. I'm going to end this here, so thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Not Let, signing off. Later, guys.